But uh, we're talking social media, and particularly Snapchat and LinkedIn. And I, I said, I'm trying to, I'm getting back in this. I just fell out. I'm maybe going to try to push for uh, Snapchat a little bit more. And we talked about a little bit of the workflow I'm using mm -hmm. uh, before the show. I, I take a video on Snapchat, and if I like it, because I can experiment, because it's Snapchat, who cares? Uh, you can download it and put it into Instagram. That gives you a nice square video instead of that vertical one that I hate as a video producer. Now you got this nice square video, and you can go stick that in Vine or Twitter video, and now you're good to go. Why don't I share the Twitter from Instagram? Because it doesn't show up. Because they don't do that. Because Twitter has a has a pissing contest with Facebook, <laughs> and uh, and they're not allowed to do that. So so Snapchat's I've been trying to get into, and and I would, it would and, and let's say LinkedIn's the other one that we've been talking about. What's been your your thing with Snapchat lately? Where, where have you been hung well, up? Well, I or and I haven't really ever gotten involved in Snapchat, and the only the only Snapchatting that I saw was like when it first started, and it was more like it was the, the ladies the, and the ladies and the kids and. Let me send you a picture of this stupid stuff for mm -hmm. for a few seconds. And back when you they you could screen capture it, and then you'd get notified, and it was like this big hoopla, whatever. And they weren't keeping it on their servers, and there was all what whatever. I I never found like a good use for it mm -hmm. past that until recently. They've put some news channels on there and some things of that nature. Have you been watching the Katie Keurig? No, I have is not. That, is that what brought you in? No, Katie Couric? Katie Couric is so lovable. It's America's sweetheart. I'm on Snapchat. <laughs> is that really what drove you to Snapchat? No, absolutely not. Although there's a great story about Katie Couric in uh, Mick Foley's first or second book. So, um, But anyways, no, but yeah, I, I think that's what kind of like, that was the, hey, CNN is here. This is here. I, I just did a course. It was one of the three uh, things that we talked about on a course uh, for nonprofits a, a, a month ago uh, with the library. I mean, people want to get on it, and I think I think who are you following? Are you following anybody significant that's doing fun stuff on there? No, I, I'm not, and that's maybe maybe that's part of the problem. And, and one of the things, like I was wondering, what do you get out of Snapchat? And one of the things that's that I'm starting to realize over time is all of, especially Facebook. I'm seeing Facebook fill in some of the Flipboard news gap. You put a lot of F's in there, man. <laughs> Wow, if, if Facebook's really filling in that that news gap that I was using Flipboard for, mm -hmm. because a lot of people post an article, and then because they have that, oh, and you might also be interested in these other news articles from other, and they're from other sites. Right. I see myself sticking on each social network as I go in, and I'm le it's I'm left I'm less apt. To do the old school, you know, flip between the channels type of thing, mm -hmm. and I'm more, more or less staying on one channel on the social media TV. I'm not really looking at it as a news source, though. I, I'm, I really am kind of looking at it as, as kind of a sorry, and yeah, entertainment, talking with people. You know, I mean that that's really it. That's that's really all I have for it. Right? Mm -hmm. it, it is that? I'm sorry. I'm, I'm kind of fussing with this so I can show off some snapchat stuff so i can't bring up the camera so make so so just pantomime what i'm talking about <laughs> over here uh but anyways but uh but no i no, generally i think it's it's a it has to be a fun thing so it, you're viewing it more of as a vine or right as, right it's a way to those... it's a way to be creative it's a way to communicate with people and and just kind of have fun with things see i guess i i look that's kind of like my twitter Right, I look at Twitter for that kind of thing more and more. Right, 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 and that's the thing. I mean, I I think as a normal person, no, why, why, why would you really get into it? But I think as a creative outlet, I think it's it's pretty remarkable for that. Now, unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to pull this up here entirely. Uh, yeah, it looks like we have some network problems, so I, I couldn't pull this up. Um, but anyways, no, I I think um, I, I think generally, uh, yeah, it's fun. It's getting a message across. Um. I don't know how to engage back, you know. Mm -hmm. I, I'm not looking at it as an informational source. It's kind of the most informational things that I have on here. Uh, I'll, I'll give you some tips on people to follow. Uh, one Taco Bell, just because they're the they're probably the best at it. <laughs> okay. Okay. Like as as somebody who's selling something online, uh, Snap a Tunde is somebody I think. Is he the one that used to write for The Onion, perhaps? He does a lot of good stories. There's this guy on here that is a director. 
and movie producer, etc. I don't know anything that he's done, but his name is Casey. Oh, uh, why isn't he on here now? Casey Neistat, I think is the name. I don't know why it's not coming up, but he is really good because stories are the thing. Like doing the individual, like I'm not going to talk to do a thing and hit all these people and send that out. I'm not. I'm I'm doing broadcasting on this mm -hmm. thing. I'm not doing one on one things, private things. I don't do a lot private. I mean, it's just me. That's you know, fine. like hey, check out the stuff we're doing. See, and that's where Here's I some be behind the scenes stuff. You know, when I'm not periscoping, I'm I'm Snapchatting, right? Um, and, and is that is that what you're looking? Yeah, and at? It, like, well, and I'm I'm just interested in why would what what. What should be getting me to open the, even the app to get on there? And that's where I'm having the problem getting into it. It depends on who you follow. Like, yeah. I want to see what some of these people are doing. Like, I have stories. For me, I have stories from the guys, the no-name no -name players doing the awesome Sister Sorella. They, they're, I think they did some Snapchats from, from the show. Uh, some friends, like Tom up in Erie, Snapatunde is somebody I listen to on podcasts all the time. It does fun stuff. New York Mag on there. New York mm -hmm. Mag. New York Magazine. Uh, they do like interviews with the cartoonists and stuff. It's kind of fun if you're into that. Uh, there's my sister-in-law. There's Bobby. Uh, hi, Bobby Cherry. Uh, Mikey and Bob. They are just all around entertaining. FS Mikey uh, 412 for that one. Uh, let's see who else is on here. Uh, 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 the Verge, uh, the Real Verge, I think, is their account on here. They will do these mini reviews. Oh, that'd be cool. See now that I could definitely get that into. you can get into. I think in gadgets on here, tech crunch is on here. I have I don't have any of them on here. Uh, WWE always does a really good behind the scenes shot of of something something behind the curtain or people coming out like at a live show. So if I look at is your profile on there and can I see who you follow? I don't think I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it works that way. Uh, you you can follow me and I don't know. Let's see, added me my friends. Let me see if I go to a friend. Let's say I go to. Uh, hello, Austin. Yeah, I can't see who, who he's followed. Follow. I can see the points he has. It's way more than me. But of course, he just graduated high school, so he's all into the Snapchats. Um, no, I, I, I think that's about it. I could screen cap my list and send it to you. <laughs> <laughs> I, and I think that's about it. And that's the thing. It's a very, like Instagram used to be. There was no web interface for the longest time in Instagram. Mm -hmm. And this is saying, we're going to be here. We're going to be mobile. And that's it. That's it. You're, you're not going to. And, and that's what the appeal is. I mean, you're not the target. You're not the target. They're trying right. to broaden with this with this crazy uh, CNN, Katie Couric stuff that they have going on here. Or uh, Comedy Central, Vice is on here, Daily Mail, ESPN. But, I mean, and the question is, when is that open to us as content producers? Mm -hmm. When...